says Dexter, he has to stock his food before he eats it. He has to flick each piece out individually. Sometimes licking it off his paw, and sometimes throwing it somewhere and going after it. It's fascinating to watch him how he eats. One at a time. And then that one wasn't good enough, so we go to another one. Mm -hmm. And that's Ellie in the background, because she's high maintenance. <laughs> He has to flick it out with his paw, one at a time, and lick it off the bottom of his paw. Can't just eat it out of the bowl with his mouth, no. That's why I have a towel down. It's his placemat. This is a long process. So far it's been a minute and ten seconds and he's eaten like six pieces. Ellie, shush! That ain't happening. Looks it off the bottom of his paw. I've been meaning to film him doing this for a long time because it's just fascinating. Licks it off the bottom of his paw. But he will not just eat it with his mouth out of the bowl. Each piece has to be extracted out with his paw, either eaten off the bottom of his paw or flicked somewhere, and then gone after it. Mm-hmm. And so is the process of Dexter eating. Mm-hmm. He's like a raccoon. He holds his food with his little paw and eats it. I think if I gave him silverware, he'd probably use them. Ellie, shush! She wants to be part of this. She already had dinner, though. Did I mention Dexter's only three and a half pounds? He's a little tiny guy. Okay, so, well, there you have it. As you can see, this takes a long time for him to finish a meal.